is HSA. Student Association. They're our newest A sub organization. Hapa is actually a Hawaiian word for a person of partial Asian descent. Cool, cool, cool. Like me. Cool. I was really excited to join HSA because it's an organization that caters to people who feel like they don't really have a specific place anywhere else. There's a lot of court cultural organizations, but for the, those of us who are mixed with more than one culture, it's hard to really just choose which side and just switch on off one side then the other side. Being the inaugural representative for HSA in the Miss Asia pageant puts a lot of pressure on me, not only because I feel that I have to represent us well, but also because no one knows really what HSA is and what I'm going to be doing up there. So I have to educate everyone for the first time. And it's hard to be the first. Also, I hope that in the years to come, there will be a lot more awareness and people will, there will be more involvement in HSA, there will be more members. Other organizations will acknowledge us as part of the Asian Student Union Board more thoroughly, and I just hope that I really lay the groundwork for years to come. I'm expecting to be entertained for the entire night and seeing all the beautiful Asian ladies show off all their talents. In the Miss Asia pageant, there are um, several portions that go into the judging. It's a cultural show also, so there's um, before the pageant there's photo shoot and there's an online voting process so someone will be awarded most popular uh, contestant and um, then there will be a video uh, like a video interview that will be shown to the audience of each contestant explaining themselves there will be a talent portion where many people sing or dance or play an instrument and then there's a question and answer portion where you'll be wearing your cultural clothes um, and then answering questions like a regular pageant. I'm wearing a casual kimono called yukata and because I'm mixed with Japanese and African American I'm wearing a slightly Americanized version. When some people perceive me as being less Asian because of um, my mix with African American I I think it's understandable because biologically I am more African American than I am Japanese. But when it comes to how in touch I am with both of my cultures, I don't feel that I'm less of either. How do you think an Asian cultural center would benefit the Purdue community? I think that an Asian cultural center would greatly benefit the Purdue community because not only of the recent events that have been going on with um, the online social networking thing towards Asians, I think that people need to be educated about different cultures. So we have a black cultural center for that reason, a Latino cultural center, and I think an Asian cultural center should be next. If I win the Miss Asia pageant, I will be very surprised. I'm going into the pageant to represent HSA and to spread awareness, but I'm not necessarily expecting that I need to win. If I win, I will definitely be happy, but it will be a surprise. For the second runner-up of the 2012 Miss Asia Pageant and Cultural Show, Miss HSA. She really just did it for the fun, just for the experience and to represent her club. So we never even thought that she would come close to placing second. So when she did place second, it was like a pleasant surprise. So we're just
was fun. It was a good experience. We didn't expect any more than a good time, but we got second. So that's even better. If I could say one thing to everyone, it would be just to keep an open mind and think before you judge. I'm just really shocked that I got second place. I was hoping that I would place, but I didn't think I'd get second. So I'm just really happy. I did this for fun, but it turned out a lot better than I thought it would. And all the 